Paul Stitch's 103rd birthday by a Google Doodle in India and Germany. Marga Falstich was born on this day in 1915 in Weimar. She was a German chemist. She worked for shot glass work for 44 years and developed more than 300 types of optical glasses during this time. During this time, she filed around 40 patents. She was also the first female executive at shot glass and mines. Marga Falstich was born in Weimar as one of three children. In 1922, the family moved to Jena where Marga Falstich attended the Raoul Gymnasium. After graduating from high school in 1935, she began her apprenticeship as glass worker in one of the leading manufacturers of optical and technical special glass in Europe. In her first years she worked on the development of thin films. In 1939 the research group submitted the first patent. Since then, basic research has been used for sunglasses, anti-glare lenses or glass facades. The gifted young woman quickly made a career, from assistant to laboratory assistant, to scientific assistant and finally to a scientist. Her fiancé died in the Second World War and from then on, she focused solely on her career. From 1942 she studied extra occupational chemistry. Marga Falstich was able to devote herself to the research and development of new optical glasses, in particular for lenses on microscopes and binoculars. In addition to research, Marga Falstich conducted a crucible melt for 16 years. Marga Falstich received international recognition for the invention of the heavyweight spectacle lens Schwerflin 64, SF64, for which she was awarded the IR100 Medal of Industrial Research and Corporation in Chicago in 1973 as one of the 100 most important technical innovations of the year. In 1979 she retired after 44 years at shop. The following years she spent traveling all over the world, but also gave lectures and lectures at glass congresses. At the age of 82, she dried